Hey, you guys, welcome back to today's module. Um, in this video, you guys, I'm going to simply show you how I send out broadcast email. This is like real day in the life um, in the trenches, sending out emails, right? This is part of my email marketing. This is part of my overall marketing. This is what I truly believe every single one of you guys need to be implementing. Um, whether you're a real estate agent or an insurance agent or a local plumber, whatever. My whole, my, my whole, whole, passion really is just teaching local business owners how to really dominate, right? how to take over their local area, right? Um, and even if you're building nationwide, if you're building nationwide, same exact thing. As we're in this, this, the scale of social media, right? As, as social media has really taken off and, and exploded 2023 and beyond, it's obviously important that, that us as business owners are on social media, but the number one, number one goal for every single business owner, it doesn't from, from small to, to, to freaking extra large. The number one goal is to, is to eventually take that attention or take that individual, take a piece of that audience off of the platform, get them to opt in to your world. And that happens with a free download that happens with a, a free PDF, a free ebook, a free training, a free case study, a free video, a free, um, anything, right? That's where it starts. So again, a lot of you guys being real estate agents, a free download, a free buyer guide, a free seller guide. Um, you're out there promoting a listing, you're out there promoting an open house, getting them to click, come over to your page where they enter your world. They enter their name and email and opt in. That should be the number one goal for every single business owner on social media. You have to be able to take that person off eventually, okay? Um and get them into your world and that happens with simple email marketing. That happens with simple um email domination. This is the basics, right? So so as I take an individual off off the platform, again, whether they came from a listing um funnel, a, an open house funnel, a free download funnel, um whatever, what what whatever it may be, right? They're they're opting in. Once I have that person on my list, number one, they're going to be on a list, right? That's number one. They opt in, they enter their name and email into a form. They're now on a quote unquote list, right? That list, nine out of 10 times, in fact, I'll just show you, here's the list. So I use Kartra for everything, right, you guys? So if you haven't activated a 14-day trial, I don't know what you're waiting for um, because all these email softwares out there, you guys, I've been using Kartra since 2018. It's what I've taught on this entire time. It's what I recommend still to this day, 2023 and beyond. I'm still recommending Kartra. And it's really because of the price point, really the price point and obviously the software, the technology behind it. Um, because I'm an affiliate, I'm on different conference calls with Kartra executives, with Car with the Kartra board members, with the owners of Kartra. Um, and again, I've been promoting it hardcore since 2018, all my clients. It really came um, first because of, of the tools, but because of the price point. In the very, very beginning, it was the price point that got me. And I'm and to tell you the truth, I'm still on that price point, which is 99 bucks a month. 100 bucks a month, that runs my entire products, my digital products. So when I charge clients, right? So so if you're charging clients, um, some of you guys are getting this are, are real estate agents, so you're not you're not charging clients, right? But if you're a coach, a consultant, a trainer, anything like that, right? Um, selling digital products, selling an ebook, selling a course, whatever. Um, I run all my products, all my transactions through Kartra. I run my email automation through Kartra, which is my email autoresponder. I run my pages, all of my landing pages, every page I could possibly need to build for anything. Um, simple templates. I run all that through pages. The form is what they opt into. Um, the membership is what you guys are in right now. You guys are in my membership course. I'm able to create this course, provide value, monetize it. It's all hosted on Kartra. So I'm here using it for many, many different reasons, right? But but it, but but in this case, with email automation, this is the most important. This is the backbone to every single business, right? So so as I get people to opt in, what I want to be able to do is, is, yeah, number one, put them on a list. Number two, put them on a sequence. The sequence is the automation. So once you're opted in, you're on a list, that's one thing. The second thing is now the automation. That's what what Karcher calls the sequence, right? So, so as you opt in today, tomorrow you get an automated email. Two days later, you get an automated email. A day later, you get an automated email. Three days later, I can set the days for whatever I want. They'll get an email later. And these are preset, pre-written emails that I would have put together, right? Pre, and then boom, I just load the sequence and 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 away 
automation goes. So, so powerful, you guys. Because again, as you're building your brand on social media, that's where people are seeing you, right? Whether it's a YouTube channel that you're creating, whether you're just simply posting on Facebook, you're simply posting on Instagram, that's really the only time your audience sees you. They need to see you again. They need to see you again. That's why video form is so, so powerful. YouTube channel is so, so powerful because, okay, if you found me on Instagram, that's one thing. You're seeing my feed. You found me on Facebook. We're friends on Facebook. That's one thing. You're, you're, you're seeing my feed. Um, but, 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 if, but, but where, where else am I showing up? Right. Where else am I showing up? That's why video you'll be seeing me on YouTube, right? My video. That's another touch point. So all of these different things in business are touch points to the audience. I'm going to touch you on Facebook. I'm going to touch you on Instagram. I'm going to touch you on YouTube. And I'm for sure going to touch you on the back end, which is email automation. Okay. So, so you, so as they opt into your listing funnel, your open house funnel, whatever your free download funnel, they're on a list. Then you want to tie it to a sequence so you have a handful of emails that are preset ready to go out automatically, right? And then whenever you randomly just simply, I don't know, in your business, you're following because you're 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 the authority in your industry, you're the one staying educated with everything, right? Because that's that's the value you eventually start to start to give to your to your potential clients and and prospects, right? You're always staying educated. So if you're real estate, you're always staying educated. You're probably going to conferences, meetings, you're probably affiliated with 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 NAR, you're probably affiliated with you're probably a realtor, right? So now you're going to, to to annual events through the through 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 the realtor association, right? So so you're always staying up on 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 game, right? Let's just put it that way. You're always staying educated, right? And 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 that's that gives you the the the, the leverage to to attract you know more more business, right? So in this case, for example, something happens in your in your industry news flash headline news alert whatever or 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 as as easy as as what i'm doing today what i'm doing today you guys as i'm training you at the same time is i'm setting up a broad a broadcast so now we're going to go into broadcast broadcast is a one off email so whenever something randomly happens and some news i want to share it with a certain list um or maybe my whole database, whatever, I can come in here and send, send a broadcast email. So no matter what email platform you're using, whatever CRM you're using, um, you should have the capability of broadcast email. Sequences is your automation, right? Your preset emails, but the broadcast is a one-off, right? So today, again, day in the life, I'm training you. I'm preaching. I'm, 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 what does it go? How's the saying go? I'm, 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 I'm teaching what I'm preaching or I'm just doing what I'm doing. I'm doing what I'm teaching. Right. Um, because I just released a YouTube video. So what I want to do with that YouTube video is I want to send out a broadcast. I could for sure put it in a sequence and have it go out at the end of the sequence. Let's say I have 17 emails that are already preset in that sequence. Okay. Today's YouTube video could be email number 18 in that sequence, right? So one email is going out every three days, for example, and I have 17 ready. And, and now I'm now I have this new YouTube video. So I'm gonna I'm gonna simply add it and it'll be number 18 in that sequence. It's like, dude, that could be that that, that could, that's good. That's good. Obviously, that's super, super good. That's why you want to make your content evergreen because because if a lead opts in today, there's 17 more emails that they're going to be getting every three days before they even get to this YouTube video, right? In this case with the YouTube video. So yes, I want to add it to my sequence, but I want people to see it now. Like I want people to see it today. I want this email to, to, to reach certain people, you know, with, within the next, you know, few minutes type of thing. That's a broadcast. That's a broadcast. Okay. And, and so this, this is what you're going to always want to send out broadcast, like probably like it's at least maybe once a week, right? If you're out there really working and grinding and, and creating content and just continually to, continually sharpening your sword and, and getting better in your industry, you're going to always have news to share. You're going to always have, have, have more content and more value to bring to, to, to your audience. And again, what do most people do? They'll just take that and post it on LinkedIn. They'll take that and post it on Facebook. It's like, dude, you're, you're, you're taking that and you're posting it to your 1100 followers on Instagram when they're all across the country and you're a local business owner. So none of these people are in your market anyways. 
it's like, dude, you got to, you got to, you got to know who you're educating, man. And you got to, you got to really know, know, know the value. And, 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 and so the broadcast, you guys, the broadcast, I'm going to always continue to educate my audience. And, and I'm going to always try to send out a broadcast at least, at least once a week, because something always new is evolving in, 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 in any industry. And it's, and that's good content. That's stuff you want to share. So rather than just simply posting it, like you guys are organically doing now, Start building a list, start building a list, run ads. And, and if you're posting organically, make sure you're, you're, you're posting links to your landing page where you can capture the lead. It's all about the lead. You guys, I can't stress that enough. Okay. So, so here in today, I just released a, a, a YouTube video, literally just, just an hour ago, really actually. Yeah. Not even, yeah. An hour ago. And I want to promote this to a, to a handful of people on, on, on certain lists, right? So here's how I do it. I click on communications to the left, and this is how I do it in Kartra. So again, if you haven't activated your 14-day trial, there's a button below, activate a 14-day trial, because this software at the price point, I'm teaching you how to use the entire thing. And if you're in the real estate space, you've gotten all those funnels for free. The listing funnel, the open house funnel, the seller guide funnel, the buyer list funnel, the CMA funnel, right? So, so that's a whole added value right there. I just saved you literally a few thousand um, by just giving you those funnels. So jump on the software with me, activate it. This is one major, major important component within it. And that's the, the, the communications. This is your, your email marketing. Okay, so I'm gonna click on communications to the left. I'm gonna come over here, hover over communications and I'm gonna go broadcast. Okay, so now all, all over here, these are all just past broadcasts that I've done, right? So um over here, I'm going to click on the green one, and I'm going to name this broadcast. The name of this broadcast is simply what whatever I want to name it, right? Like, like this is regarding a YouTube video. I'm going to be blasting out, writing out an email, getting people to my YouTube video. Um, this is this is crush it. This is crush it, crush it with Facebook video ads. And no one sees this part. This is just internal. Um, I'm just I'm just giving it a name, right? So, and then the category that I'm going to put this in is going to be the FB ads cheat sheet. Yeah, I'll just throw it in that one. Um, for now, that's fine. And then create. Okay, so so now I'm going to go through the the basic setup. This is step one: send by email. That's the email it's coming from, um, being sent from, and that, and then if that lead were to apply, they're replying to that email. And I can change these out too. I can change it. I can put whatever, but it has to be a business email. It has to be a business email. This cannot be your Gmail or or Yahoo or whatever. Like this has to be your 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 um your your business email. Okay, so I'm gonna hit save and then save and next. And then here is where I can, I can, I can, this, this is why I love Kartra, you guys. That's why shout out to Russell Brunson, shout out to ClickFunnels, shout out to all these other Kajabi and, and softwares, but, but, but Kartra is so simple. It's so freaking powerful. And at the price point, it's yet to be beat. Like it's yet to be beat. So, so that's why I, I, I continue to use it. I'm an av, I'm an avid user of it. Um, I'm an advocate. I, I promote it. Um, because I truly believe this is what it's all about, man. We're all shaking our ass and, and, and trying to build an audience on social media. You got to get them off. If, if you're building an audience, you got to get a, a, a piece of that audience off and into your world. You need software on the back end to make it happen. And this one's super basic, you guys, Kartra. So there's a fortune day trial. Click the button below. Um, click the link below and and, and activate it, okay? And I'll, and I'll help you with all this stuff. Um, so in this case, with the recipients... This is where I really narrowed in. Now, I base a lot off of tags. I'm always trying to tag a person. So whatever funnel I create, the moment they opt in, they're tagged, right? So so that allows me to really filter future emails um, and, 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 and for sure filter broadcast emails. Everything is based on a tag. Um, or I can go everyone subscribe to a list. It's there, There's all these different criteria, all these different ones. So in this case, I'm going to simply put down... Um, has tag. I'm going to base everything off of my tag, right? So has tag, has tag FB ads cheat sheet. Okay. Um, FB ads cheat sheet. I'm going to put the people that are going to receive this email. They have that tag um, or, or, or they are subscribed. I'll do actually, you know, I'll do another tag or has tag um, clients. I'll go with this other, this other client list, or they have that tag right or they have that tag um and and also when it yeah or, or they have that tag and then and then is there any other one um i'll leave it i'll leave it at that this is and here's the thing too you guys you'll see some people that have lists that have thousands and thousands of people on the list some people will brag that they got that they got ten thousand plus you know emails on a list 
what, what they're not saying is the fact that X amount and a good X amount, a good percentage of that 10,000 lists, for example, are unsubscribes and, 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 and undeliverable, um, where, where the email was wrong, for example. Right. And so people like that tend to not even account for that and not even clean their list. I clean my list like once a, once a week, like anyone that unsubscribed, I take them off, take them out, completely take them out of my system. So it doesn't go against my number. Right. Um, if they unsubscribe, I take them out. If it's a, if it's a bounced email, so they put in the wrong email, um, I take it out. So that number doesn't reflect. So my my number, man, my small list is freaking powerful. My open rate is powerful. These are people who really want to hear from me, right? Um, they're engaging. They're opening. They're opening my emails, right? They click on my emails. So you always want to scrub your email list. Get rid of all the bad emails in there. Um, and and only focus in on that small list. You don't need tens of thousands. Yes, for sure you'll get there, for sure. And 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 yeah, for sure. Um, but as long as you clean them and 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 stay engaged with this email, that's why you want to broadcast at least once a week. Broadcast once a week. This is my once a week right here that I'm doing with you guys, and I'm just turned it into a training video. Um, but but this is what you want to do. So so I'm gonna send it to this this highly engaged, smaller list, um, people who have downloaded this recently um, and, and then recent recent clients of mine, um, not full-blown coaching clients. That's one small list of, of just, just random, cl basic clients, I should say. Um, not random, but basic clients. I have different levels in my in my coaching. So that's my, that's my level one client list. And I'm going to go save and next. That's it, save and next. And then I'm going to hit single email. And then all I'm going to do is simply go to rich HTML. I want to work out of rich HTML. In here, I could choose all these different templates. These are all different templates that Kartra already has available. So, so I can literally just take any of these templates, click, drag it over, drop it there, and then boom, work off of this template. I can change everything about it. The color that's not my yellow, then boom, I want to change it to freaking pink whatever, right? I can save colors. I can create palettes, right? I can link that button somewhere, right? So so if I want to link it somewhere, or if I want to just completely take the button out, I could completely take the button out, right? I can change out this image right here and put a, a completely different image. I can link the image. Um, if I don't want the one, two, three, I could just delete it, right? Just delete it, right? If I don't need this this bottom part right here, I'll just delete it, right? So what I, what I normally do is all come in here on the very, very, very first email and I'll, and I'll completely optimize my template, right? I'm going to change out the copyrights. I'm going to change out the, 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 the social icons. Um, if I don't need phone number, I'm going to, I'm going to take that out. Right. So, so I'm going to optimize it and fully, fully deck it out. I can create my own. I can, I can click, drag it over and just simply create my own, um, or I can, yeah, out of all of these different ones, like I can add a countdown clock. I can get super, super creative with it, you guys, right? I can, I can, I can um, put a countdown clock and I can base the countdown clock off of, um, off of, off of a fixed day, off of a date, fixed day and time, fixed date and time um, based on a due date. So I can even base it off of a tag, right? If they have a tag, then, 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 then make this countdown clock countdown, right? So, so I can get super, super fancy with it, you guys, but, but, but also keep it simple at the same time. So once I really get my template, right? Once I get my template, then I would save. Once I create my template, I'm going to do it one time, change out the blue, maybe, add, maybe, maybe create a different color, whatever, man, right? I can, I can do whatever I want to this template. And then what I would do is I would save it, save as template, right? That's what I would do. I would save as template. Now, in this case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just get rid of this real quick because I already have a simple template and my, my template is basic, but, but the reason why you want to simply create a template one time and then save it is so it saves you all the time in the future. This is my basic, basic template. Um, let me drag, click, drag it over. There's my tech spot. There's my button to where if I want to link someone to, um, and then maybe I'll put a pic, a picture down here. Um, in fact, I have, the YouTube thumbnail picture. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to put that here. That's the YouTube thumbnail picture. So boom, that goes right there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to link that video. So I'm going to go to that video. Um, let me switch out accounts real quick. So let's go to this one. And then right here. So this video, and this is what I want you guys doing. So if you guys are, if you guys are, um, 
let me switch account again. If you guys are building a YouTube channel, this is what you want to broadcast often, right? You want to put your 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 YouTube videos obviously in your sequence, right? Let me let me grab today's video. Obviously in in the sequence, but the broadcast too, man. Get more attention to the 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 video the moment it, it's released, right? That's a broadcast. So boom, I'm gonna share. I'm gonna get that link. That's all I did there. I got the link, and then I'm gonna bring it over here, and I'm gonna link the image. I'm gonna link the image, and then I'm also going to link this button right here. And I'm gonna change out the color. I'm gonna I'm gonna go down to my YouTube red, and and all I did is I simply chose the color, and then I hit the three dots, create palette. That's how you can create it, right? And then you could just save a bunch of colors, right? So there, there, there's the the but the but the color of the button, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna change out this text. Click here to click here, click here to watch today's video. That's it. That's it. And then boom, this button that right there is is the link. That's the link. And then I'm going to write out the text. And then I'll even link my little logo down here. I'll even link that to the YouTube video. So now I'm going to just simply write out some text and we'll be on our way. Give me one second. Okay, you guys, just wrote out something super simple and basic. And here's another thing too, you guys, when it comes to these emails. Authenticity is the most important. Communicating with leads as if they were your friends is the most important. Right. No need to be super corporate. No need to sound too company like no no need to, to sound fake, like keep it real, like treat these people like like you're texting your friend. That's that's just my professional opinion. That's my personal personal pro professional opinion. Um, you want to dumb it down. And that's the whole thing about social media. We we are attracted to to, to people. Right. We are attracted to, to to socializing. Right. That's what we gravitate to. We are social beings. So that's that that's why social media is so freaking um, um, just magical is because we're connecting with people. That's all it is. We're connecting with people being human beings connect with human beings. Bottom line. And, and so as you're bringing people into your into your world, right, you're taking them off of the platform, you're bringing them into your world, talk to them like you're, they were your buddy, right? Talk to them as, as if they were your, 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 your pal, right? And, and that's what I, what I try to do. And I try to keep it short, right? Not too long. There's some marketers that will really write stories in this email, right? They'll, they'll write freaking 17 paragraphs and it's, and, 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 and they work, they, they actually work, they convert, they work. But 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 in my opinion, as a consumer, I like shorter and, and go with based on what you kind of prefer, right? This is your business. Um, you want to tailor it towards the audience for sure, but also you're a consumer. So how do you like things done, right? How how do you how do you read your emails, right? For example, you know. So in my case, when when I get emails that are super lengthy, I don't read them. Like I don't read them, and they could be coming from the most credible marketer. In my case, they could be coming from the most credible business person, right? But but sometimes I, I don't even read them. Um, and if I do, it, it, I'll maybe read it two weeks later when I get freaking five minutes to spare because it's going to take five minutes to read it right um but but many emails come through me come 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 to me um from other marketers that that i re, right like that i really look up to and, and aspire to be right people that i'm learning from just like you guys learn from me i'm learning from others as well and and i have emails that come through that are short and sweet and to the point and 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 the whole objective is to get me to click right that's the whole objective so rather than getting me lost in your freaking 19 paragraph story Make it short and sweet and get me to click, get me to click. And what I'm encouraging all you guys to do, 20, 23 and beyond, I'm encouraging all of you to start putting videos on YouTube. Start putting videos on YouTube. Put videos on Facebook for sure. Um, if you're doing reels on IG, okay, cool. But but for sure on YouTube, start building a YouTube channel. So in this case, what I do in my a lot of my broadcast email is that's all I'm trying to do is get attention to that video right away. That, that and it keeps it that's and I keep it that simple. It is that basic um, when it comes to my 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 part of the back end of, of my marketing, right? So here, quick little short to the point email. It's all about getting them to click. It's all about getting them to watch here. So I'm going to hyperlink this word watch here. And I'm going to simply come down to, um, <clears throat> let me just click it again. Here goes this right here. And I'm going to link. There is the YouTube video watch here, right? And that's it. And I'll, and I might bolt. Yeah, it's already bolted. So we're good there. And then 
And that is it, you guys. So we got this hyperlinked, right? We got the button linked. We got the image linked. We even got the logo link, right? So, so again, find find your template. And these are just dynamic variables. I'll use their first name a lot, you guys. These are dynamic variables. So right here, um, in here, you got we got all the templates where we can build a template. But up here, we have the dynamic variables. I'll use their first name, you know, a lot. I'll use it in the subject line. I'll use it in the body of the text, the body of the email. Um, let's see how I could put it up here in the subject line. Um, Jack, um, this is how you dominate. This is how you dominate a local area. Okay, this is how you dominate a local area. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's simple. So, okay. So now again, if it was my first template, I would save as template and be able to use that over and over and over again. Right. So I put their first name in the subject line. I put their first name down here. Hi, Jack. Um, I put their first name down here. Start targeting your local area, Jack, and dominate. Right. Um, it can happen. It can, it, it can all happen. It can, it can, it can all happen. It can all happen with simple Facebook video ads. Here's how to set it up. Watch here. Okay. That's it. That's it. That's it. Okay, cool. And then we're going to go save and next. Save and next, you guys. And then we don't need any any automation right now. So we don't we don't need to do any of that. Schedule. So I can I can save it as a draft. I can schedule for later. I can send now. I'm going to send this bad boy now. Save and next. Yes. And that's it, you guys. Congratulations. Went to 314. Now, what I like, what I what I really, really love about Kartra as well is the fact that I can track all my leads. I can track the activity. I can track the click, the, the engagement, the open rate. I can track all that in real time. So right here, I'm not positive, pausing the video. I'm not, not editing this part at all. Um, we are literally in real time right now. This is live where I'm going to simply a few seconds later, I don't even think it's been 60 yet, right? I'm going to come here, analytics. I can go to broadcast and I can last 30 days. I can go today and boom, look at that. Four opened it already. Right at a 314, four opened it already. Um, and that's right here. So it'll show me right here. It'll even show me who sent me to spam, right? Um, it'll show me who unsubscribes and people will unsubscribe. That's totally fine. Um, but but four of them opened it that quick, right? So so I don't really micromanage this back end part, like the, the unsubscribes for sure, because and even the spam. So if someone reports me to spam. Um, I'll, I'll take them, I'll completely take them out of my database, right? Um, that's just how I do it, right? Some people will, leave, will, will will keep that list or keep that email, but it's like, no, dude, that person reported you to spam. They obviously don't like your stuff or or they unsubscribed. They obviously don't like your stuff or they put in a bad email. They obviously were only trying to, you know, opt in to maybe try to try to you know find out what the hell you're up to but but that was about it so i don't need those leads in my system i need the most 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 highest engaged most loyal followers to be receiving these emails right that's who i want and that's another thing you guys another misconception about social media and just marketing in general the fact that we think we need millions and millions of people following us no we don't no we don't like look at my youtube channel my youtube channel is still not even in the tens of thousands of subscribers at this point 2023 i'm still cracking 5000 you know subscribers on youtube but do you know how do you know how blessed i've been with with just that amount like I've gotten so many clients, shout out to every single one of you that are going through this training right now that actually found me from YouTube, right? And that's all organic. It's it's, it's video content, which I'm telling you right now is magical. You got to be creating video content on your subject, right? On your business. Um, no matter how you look, no matter what you sound like, no matter your accent, no matter where you're from, none of that matters. None of that matters. There's a piece for everyone. Um, that's why you don't need millions of people. You don't need even tens of thousands of, of leads. You need a few engaged ones, highly engaged ones, right? And I truly believe most of you guys that are getting this, this video right now, most of you guys that are going through this training, I, 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 I'm, I'm willing to bet that it doesn't take many, many clients for you to make a good income, right? For you to build a, bi a, build a big business. So, so don't worry about having tons over here. Focus on the ones that you do have. Treat every single one um, like, like, like they're your, like they're, they're your favorite one. Right. And, and really just bring value, bring value and people will stay on your list. You guys, people will engage even more and, and you'll be, you'll be closing deals and, and building, building relationships and, and clients. Seven clicks. Look at that, dude. Look at that. Actually, that's the whole, that's the whole 30 days. Let me go back to today. I was like, holy crap. Okay. Look, look at that, dude. Look at that. Again, I haven't paused the video here. You guys, we're in real time. 22 people. Look at that. The open rate 7% so far. And it, it, it hasn't even been five minutes. It has not even been five minutes. It's been like two, right? So, so look at that one unsubscribed and that's totally fine, dude. Here's what I do. I click on it. 
Mariah Lewis, whoever whoever that was. I'm going to simply click on that, and then I'm going to simply come over here and delete. That's it. I would delete the lead and completely take it out, and that's it. No big deal. All right. So, so you guys, that's how you send out broadcast emails. Um, you want to be engaging. You want to be communicating with your leads, and this is how you're going to do it. You're going to do it by 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 building the value on social media, right? Building the value putting out content and really educating your audience and then driving them to a click, driving them to a landing page where you can get them to opt in. That's where, where it starts, you guys. So I cannot encourage it enough. Uh, enough When you're running ads, when you're running ads, it's all about capturing the lead. You want to capture the lead because this is going to be another touch point that you'll be able to educate that person, build a relationship with that person, um, and eventually do business with that person. This is the back end. This is email marketing. So if you haven't activated your 14-day trial, there's a button below, and I'll see you guys in the next module.